all right continuing on building our media server so on this day i mean today we're going to install open ssh and i'm gonna try to type this fast because my mic i don't have a stand yet so let me see how i can do this okay i'm just gonna type with one hand so to do that let's do to install it let's do sudo apt install I'm not even typing anything. Oh, come on. Okay. Let's do sudo up to install open ssh dash server and hit enter. I sent our password. And there you go. Uh, in my case, I got the newest one, so there's nothing to do there. Uh, what is left to do is configure the uh, the open SSH file. So the way we're gonna configure that, it's we're gonna use sudo vi. Oh, come on! What is happening? Okay, so sudo vi etc ssh ssh underscore wait no ssh d uh, underscore config config all right so this is our ssh file and you gotta press i to edit if you're using vi and we want to scroll down here and enable port 22 you also want to enable this line right here this one too uh, okay let's scroll down skip that one and you want this one and this one too for authentication we're gonna enable all of them here and for this one you don't want it to pro prohibit we're gonna add this one not put no for this one it's not a good idea to let root user use um, SSH that's why we are restricting that yeah I don't need to explain why because you know nowadays people becoming smarter and they hack uh, you can leave those as the default um, for public key authentication oh yeah leave that on and we're gonna go all the way down to host based host based you wanna enable that one and then uh, ignore known users ignore known users yes Ignore. I think that's a yeah uh, remote. I think s yeah. Let's ignore that one. Or well, maybe let's not for a minute. Let me think about this. And yes, we're gonna need to do that. Uh, permit empty passwords. No, we don't want that uh challenge response authentication no if you want uh if you want uh two factor authentication then you would change this to yes and i think that's it so yeah so press the escape key yeah press it escape and then colon wq and write your file has been written so far so good now after we've done that um what you need to do is um restart the service okay now we go all right so we start our service sudo system system control restart 
SSH um, we want to do system control here let's do status system status and then we can just do system control status SSH and as you can see our SSH is running so now if we if you want to access this server from the outside using party all you need to do is enter the IP address and SSH in um, that's it guys that's how you install OpenSSH thank you for watching this video and stay tuned for the next one